This guy is really ruthless. I saw him stick the scissors into the elephant's face, completely disregarding the elephant's feelings. The elephant was in pain, gritting its teeth. Why did the guy treat the elephant like this? It turns out there was a boil on the elephant's face, and the guy was treating it. First, he used scissors to repeatedly puncture the boil. When a big hole was finally created, he injected medicine into the boil using a syringe. Due to his rough movements, the elephant was in great pain, stomping its feet and constantly touching the wound with its trunk. I mean, can't this guy be more gentle? After a while, the guy took out another syringe and injected more medicine into the boil while the elephant wasn't paying attention. Although the elephant knew that the guy was trying to help, it was still heartbreaking to see. After cleaning the wound, the guy took out some anti-inflammatory medicine and used his hands to comfort the elephant before injecting the medicine into the boil. The elephant was hopeless, unable to do anything but endure. Although I'm not sure if the treatment was effective, I do note that the boil on the elephant's face got bigger, which made the elephant very uncomfortable. The elephant didn't even have time to adapt before the guy took scissors and began poking around in the boil again. After some resistance, the elephant had no choice but to obey. It was clear that the elephant was very upset and had suffered a lot. When the boil was finally opened, the guy stopped. Just when I thought the treatment was over, the guy came back with scissors and inserted them into the hole, constantly rotating them inside as if the hole wasn't big enough. The elephant was in so much pain that it was trembling. Some might wonder why the guy didn't give the elephant anesthesia. This was because the elephant weighed 5 tons, and it would require a lot of anesthesia to knock it out. So the guy had no choice but to work without it. When the hole was big enough, the guy took away the scissors and began to prepare a yellow ointment. The elephant instinctively tried to retreat, but was quickly pulled back by another guy. After a few minutes, the ointment was finally ready, and the guy stuffed it into the hole despite the elephant's opposition. He then applied more anti-inflammatory medicine to the boil. Finally, the whole treatment process came to an end.